Proxima Centauri, the nearest star to our planetary group, has for some time been a subject of interest for stargazers. This little red dwarf, discovered in 1915 by Scottish cosmologist Robert Innes, is part of the Alpha Centauri system, which also includes Alpha Centauri A and B. Despite its proximity, just 4.24 light-years away, it remains invisible to the naked eye due to its relatively low brightness. However, Proxima Centauri holds significant scientific value, especially as the host star of Proxima b, an exoplanet that orbits within the star's habitable zone. Red dwarfs like Proxima Centauri are smaller, cooler, and significantly longer-lived than stars like our Sun. Their low luminosity makes them challenging to observe, but it also means their habitable zones are much closer to the star. For Proxima Centauri, this translates to an orbital distance of 0.05 astronomical units, a tiny fraction of the distance between Earth and the Sun. This proximity exposes Proxima b to intense stellar activity, including frequent solar flares and high levels of radiation, creating an environment starkly different from Earth's. The discovery of Proxima b was a remarkable achievement in exoplanet research. Using the radial velocity method, astronomers detected subtle wobbles in Proxima Centauri's position caused by the gravitational pull of an orbiting planet. These wobbles allowed scientists to measure the planet's mass and orbital period. In 2016, the European Southern Observatory officially confirmed the existence of Proxima b, marking a breakthrough in the search for potentially habitable worlds beyond our solar system. While ground-based observations have provided valuable insights into Proxima b, they come with significant limitations. Atmospheric distortion and light interference hinder Earth-based telescopes from capturing detailed data about the planet's surface or atmosphere. Most of the information we have, such as its mass, distance from the star, and orbital characteristics, is based on indirect measurements. To uncover more about Proxima b's environment and its potential for life, advanced observational instruments like the James Webb Space Telescope JWST, are essential. Proxima Centauri's role as a gateway to understanding exoplanetary systems cannot be overstated. As the closest star system to Earth, it offers a unique opportunity to study the conditions necessary for life. Proxima b, in particular, represents an intriguing possibility. A rocky, Earth-sized planet with the potential to harbor water and possibly life. However, the challenges posed by its harsh environment make it a complex puzzle for scientists to solve. The James Webb Space Telescope JWST, is not just another tool in the field of astronomy, it is a revolution. Designed as the successor to the Hubble Space Telescope, JWST was conceived to overcome the limitations of its predecessor and push the boundaries of human knowledge. While Hubble has provided invaluable insights into the universe, its capabilities are limited to visible and ultraviolet light. JWST, in contrast, is built to observe the universe in infrared wavelengths, allowing it to peer through cosmic dust and reveal phenomena invisible to Hubble. One of JWST's key features is its primary mirror, which spans an impressive 6.5 meters in diameter, more than twice the size of Hubble's mirror. This larger mirror enables JWST to collect significantly more light, making it capable of observing very faint and distant objects. Coated with a thin layer of gold to enhance its infrared reflectivity, the mirror is composed of 18 hexagonal segments that work together to create an extremely sensitive observational platform. Another groundbreaking innovation is JWST's five-layer sunshield, which keeps the telescope's instruments at a stable temperature of about minus 233 degrees Celsius. This ultra-cold environment is crucial for detecting faint infrared emissions without interference from the telescope's own heat. Unlike Hubble which orbits Earth, JWST operates from the second Lagrange point, L2, a stable position about 1.5 million kilometers from our planet. This location minimizes interference from Earth's heat and light, allowing JWST to maintain continuous observations. The telescope can study everything from the earliest galaxies to the atmospheres of exoplanets like Proxima b. Its focus on infrared light is especially significant as it enables astronomers to study redshifted objects, those whose light has been stretched to longer wavelengths as the universe expands. JWST's capabilities extend far beyond mere observation. It is designed to answer some of the most profound questions in science, including the origins of galaxies, the formation of stars, and the conditions that could support life on other planets. With its state-of-the-art instruments, including the near-infrared camera, 
NIR CAM, the Mid-Infrared Instrument, MIRI, and the Near-Infrared Spectrograph, NIR SPEC, JWST is more than a telescope. It is a time machine, a laboratory, and a testament to human ingenuity. Proxima B has captivated scientists and the public alike as a potential second Earth. Located within the habitable zone of its star, the planet has the right conditions to potentially support liquid water, a critical ingredient for life as we know it. With a mass approximately 1.17 times that of Earth, Proxima B is likely a rocky planet with a composition similar to our own. Its proximity to Earth, just over four light years away, makes it an ideal target for studying the potential for life beyond our solar system. However, Proxima B is far from an identical twin of Earth. One of its most striking characteristics is that it is tidally locked, meaning one side of the planet is in perpetual daylight while the other is in eternal darkness. This creates a unique environment with extreme temperature differences between the two hemispheres. The region where day meets night, known as the Terminator Line, may offer a narrow habitable zone with conditions moderate enough to support life. The challenges posed by Proxima B's environment are significant. Its host star, Proxima Centauri, is a red dwarf known for its intense solar flares, which can release bursts of X-rays and ultraviolet radiation. These flares could strip away the planet's atmosphere over time, exposing its surface to the harshness of space. If Proxima B retains any atmosphere, it likely requires a strong magnetic field to shield it from radiation. Without such protection, its surface environment would be hostile to life as we know it. Despite these challenges, scientists remain optimistic about the potential for life on Proxima B. The planet's location within the habitable zone suggests that liquid water could exist either on its surface or in subsurface reservoirs. Life could adapt to the harsh conditions, much like extremophiles on Earth. Organisms that thrive in extreme environments such as deep-sea hydrothermal vents or high radiation zones. These adaptations could include radiation resistance, subsurface habitats, or unique biochemical processes. The search for life on Proxima b is more than just a scientific endeavor, it is a quest to answer one of humanity's oldest questions. Are we alone in the universe? Proxima b represents a tantalizing opportunity a rocky, Earth-like world that could harbor the conditions necessary for life. As our technology advances, so too does our ability to explore this fascinating planet and uncover its mysteries. While Proxima b offers exciting possibilities, its environment is heavily influenced by the nature of its host star, Proxima Centauri. Unlike our Sun, Proxima Centauri is a red dwarf, smaller, cooler, and significantly less luminous. Its reduced size and temperature mean that its habitable zone is much closer, pulling Proxima b into an orbit just 0.05 astronomical units from the star. About 20 times closer than Earth is to the Sun. This proximity creates a unique set of challenges for the planet and any potential life it might host. One major issue is Proxima Centauri's stellar activity, particularly its intense and frequent solar flares. These flares are sudden powerful bursts of energy that emit high doses of X-rays and ultraviolet radiation. Such events are far more common and energetic in red dwarfs than in stars like our Sun. For Proxima b, this means a constant barrage of high-energy particles, which could strip away the planet's atmosphere over time. Without a protective magnetic field, any atmosphere on Proxima b would be vulnerable to erosion, leaving its surface exposed to harsh radiation. Even if Proxima b retains some of its atmosphere, the radiation from Proxima Centauri presents severe challenges to life. Elevated levels of ultraviolet radiation can break molecular bonds, preventing the formation of complex organic compounds necessary for life. This would severely limit the potential for life to develop or sustain itself on the planet's surface. On Earth, organisms like Deinococcus radiodurans have evolved mechanisms to repair DNA damage caused by radiation suggesting that life on Proxima b, if it exists, might require similar adaptations. The exploration of Proxima b is not just a step toward understanding a single planet, it is a gateway to studying exoplanetary systems as a whole. As one of the closest exoplanets to Earth, Proxima b provides a unique opportunity to investigate the conditions that might support life elsewhere in the galaxy. While its harsh environment presents numerous challenges, its existence within the habitable zone and its proximity to Earth make it a compelling target for future research. Advances in technology, such as the capabilities offered by the James Webb Space Telescope, 
will play a critical role in uncovering the secrets of Proxima b. By studying its atmosphere, surface composition, and potential for water, scientists hope to answer profound questions about the planet's habitability and the broader potential for life in the universe. Could comparatively adjust anyway. The degree of radiation opposition required would be outrageous, perhaps requiring completely new biochemistries. Curiously, Proxima b's tidally locked nature might offer some security. While one half of the globe faces steady radiation from Proxima Centauri, the planet's clouded side could act as a shelter. Subsurface territories or profound caverns could safeguard potential life structures from the worst of the radiation. Comparably, assuming Proxima b has subsurface seas, they could provide a stable, radiation-free environment where microbial life could flourish, similar to the ecosystems around hydrothermal vents on Earth. In spite of these difficulties, researchers remain confident that Proxima b's extreme climate provides a unique opportunity to study the resilience of life. By observing how organisms could survive or even thrive under such circumstances, analysts can expand their understanding of what makes a planet habitable. Proxima b isn't just a potential home for life. It is a natural lab for testing the limits of life itself. The planet's proximity to Earth and its position within the habitable zone of its star make it an ideal candidate for further study. With new telescopes and instruments, researchers will continue to monitor Proxima b for signs of habitability and life. Though the road ahead is fraught with challenges, Proxima b offers a fascinating glimpse into the possibilities of life beyond Earth. It serves as a reminder that our quest for knowledge and the search for life on other planets is just beginning. The exploration of exoplanets like Proxima b plays a vital role in broadening our understanding of what conditions are necessary for life to exist. One of the key factors that make Proxima b so intriguing is its relatively Earth-like size and composition, which makes it an excellent candidate for studying the potential habitability of planets outside our solar system. Researchers are particularly focused on finding planets with similar characteristics to Earth, as they offer the most promising conditions for the development of life. To further explore the possibility of life on Proxima b, astronomers are using various state-of-the-art techniques to analyze the planet's atmospheric composition and environmental conditions. One of the most promising methods is the study of exoplanet atmospheres through transmission spectroscopy. This technique involves observing how light from a star passes through an exoplanet's atmosphere during a transit, which can reveal the chemical makeup of the atmosphere. By analyzing the absorption lines in the spectrum of light, researchers can detect the presence of gases like oxygen, methane, and carbon dioxide, which are often associated with life on Earth. Detecting such gases on Proxima b could provide strong evidence that the planet could support biological processes. Moreover, Scientists are investigating the possibility of microbial life beneath the surface of Proxima b. The idea of subsurface life has gained momentum in recent years, especially with the discovery of extremophiles on Earth. Organisms that thrive in environments once thought to be inhospitable, such as deep-sea vents or acidic lakes. Subsurface oceans or springs could provide a stable and protected environment, shielding life from the harsh radiation and solar flares that bombard the planet's surface. If Proxima b has a liquid water reservoir beneath its surface, it could increase the chances of finding microbial life adapted to extreme conditions, much like Earth's deep-sea organisms. In addition to the search for life, Proxima b also offers a valuable opportunity to learn more about the broader processes governing planetary systems. The planet's location within the habitable zone of its star provides a unique chance to study the interactions between a planet and its host star as well as how these interactions influence a planet's ability to sustain life. For instance, the frequent solar flares emitted by Proxima Centauri may play a significant role in shaping the atmospheric conditions of Proxima b. These flares could affect the planet's climate, weather, and even its magnetic field, all crucial factors in determining whether the planet can support life. While the study of Proxima b is still in its early stages, advancements in observational technology, such as the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, offer researchers new tools to delve deeper into the mysteries of this exoplanet. The JWST's infrared capabilities will enable more detailed analysis of the planet's atmosphere, surface, and potential signs of habitability. As our understanding of exoplanets continues to grow, Proxima b will remain at the forefront of efforts to answer one of the most profound questions in science. Is there life beyond Earth? Ultimately, the study of Proxima b is not just about finding alien life but also about learning more about the conditions that make a planet habitable.
By understanding the factors that contribute to a planet's ability to support life, scientists can apply this knowledge to other exoplanets in the future, expanding our search for life in the universe. The exploration of Proxima b is just one step in a long journey to uncover the vast and mysterious realm of planets beyond our solar system. The study of Proxima b also contributes to our understanding of planetary formation and the evolution of star systems. By examining the relationship between Proxima b and its host star, Proxima Centauri, astronomers can gain insights into the dynamics of planets orbiting red dwarf stars. These stars, which make up the majority of stars in our galaxy, present unique challenges and opportunities for planet formation. The interactions between a red dwarf and its planets, particularly regarding stellar radiation and magnetic fields, can provide valuable clues about the types of planets that can form in such environments and their potential for habitability. Furthermore, Proxima b's location near a nearby star system raises questions about the formation and migration of planets. It is possible that Proxima b may have originated farther from its star and moved inward over time. Understanding the mechanisms behind such planetary migration could help explain how habitable zones in other systems evolve and shift over billions of years, potentially altering the conditions for life on planets like Proxima b. As we continue to explore exoplanets, Proxima b stands as a critical piece in the puzzle of understanding where life might exist beyond Earth. Its study offers a glimpse into the future of exoplanet research and the broader search for life in the universe.